What's up guys? I'm out here at the range today with Byron Rogers and mm. myself and we are zeroing. So this is something Byron and I do on a monthly basis. We bring all of our rifles, anything we might be using on duty out and re-zero. Not just your irons, but your dots and everything else. Also, we change all our batteries and our optics every month. This is a new uh, P07 that I put an Acro on top of. This is my kind of do it all everyday duty gun right here. Boom. The reason I'm using this rest is primarily because I want to take as much human air out of the uh, the zeroing as possible. Even when we punch back to 50 and then confirming it 200, I will use bags and a rest and everything on my rifle as much as I possibly can. I started out up here with the Acro, did about a half turn, half turn down, hit me here, did a full turn down, hit me right here, and these were my three shots. This is Byron's rifle. It's the Mark 114 from PWS. Yeah. It is a uh, long stroke piston design. He's got a Surefire 300 on here with a Warden. In California, we gotta have comps on our guns. As you can see, we all have comps, um, either pinned and welded like on this one. Uh, over here, this is one of my primary rifles. This is what I shoot most of my matches with and such. Um, it's kind of a hodgepodge rifle. It's something Barry Duke built me, but it's an FN barrel with a rifle length gas system and the barrels from Terran Butler. Just went back to the 50 and here's what we got. I started off here with my, uh, with my Terran rifle, with the competition rifle. And um, then I came, I, I made my adjustments, then I re-came over here and this is my five shot group. I'm pretty happy with that, about an inch. Then I had two here. I over adjusted and hit this guy. So I felt good elevation wise. Then I just came over and then I shot this four around group, which I'm really happy with on the dot, especially with the lighting we got. We're shooting sun into uh, shade right now. It's kind of weird, but um, you know, with the dot. On, on the PRS gun, I'm a little more picky about what the light's doing and whatnot when I do zero that rifle. But um, for this, I'm pretty happy with the dot being on this three inch paster. Boom, if you enjoyed that video, I wanna invite you to the Civilian Protector Project. Online training, live meetings online and in person, in-person training, it's for everybody. I look forward to welcoming you to our community. ProtectorNation.com, let's go.